Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Game Dev Tycoon. My name is Weasel, and we're going to develop another game. Um, this time, what are we going to develop? Oh, Beverly Larand. La Hi, boss. I have a neck for security. Think we could really do some security upgrades in our office. Yes, let's invest that. Let's invest that because I remember someone stealing my code in another playthrough. And that was really not nice at all. Okay, let's develop a new game. Um, let's see for which platform. Um, we got a PC figured out pretty well so far. We're gonna go with the game. Wait, what is this market share? 23%, that is actually pretty awesome. Yeah, let's, let's do that. <sighs> what would kids like? Um, would they like racing on the Game Boy? Young people? I mean, young people do like the gambling and they like racing, so that's maybe a good combination. Um, racing action game and um, hmm, on the Wonder uh, Weaselkin. So it's 3D on a Game Boy because 3D on a Game Boy always looked so fantastically shitty. Gonna go with that. Um, let's call it um, Cruisin. Cru cru cruise and Bumblefuck. Um, let's let's now nah, let's not put that one. Cruising, cruising, cru oh, I'm so bad. <sighs> okay, the need for heap. That's that's what we're gonna go with. The need for heap. Um, just like that. Let's see how good it turns out. Gonna have a problem if. We're gonna develop sequels on based on that title, but eh, I'm gonna risk it. The need for heap. Um, I do like the games, generally speaking. Um, I mean, I don't play them, but they kind of look fun. I played a few. Very early, I played Need for Speed 1 and 2. Um, that I enjoyed a lot. And The Hot Pursuit. Um, the old one. I really enjoyed that one, too. 350,000 for Public Toilet Tycoon. I'd say that's that's pretty neat. Um, ooh, racing. Um, yeah, let's go with that. That looks actually pretty good. To have a good AI to fight against. Ooh, the SNES. Yay. The TES, the, the Super TES. Um, I have been waiting for this and it seems they will not be disappointed. Probably, probably. We're gonna... We should develop, like, our... Uh, Prison RPG on that one, I think. Mmm, racing, needs good sound, good graphics, screw the wealth design. There we go. <sighs> Let's hope that goes well. Um, oh, we got a few points. I, I think I think technology could be a record, but I might be wrong. Come on, finish it up. There we go. Good boy. Yeah, a new record for technology. Not that technology is that important, but it helps. It helps. These coffee mugs, they never get cold and nobody drinks them, ever. Will there be a sequel for Game Dev Tycoon? I just realized. I should look that up. I hope so. Hope so. In 3D. Has to be 3D. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, beautiful. The need for heap is beautiful. Let's, let's generate a game report so we have an idea what happened here. Uh... Oh, I'm making a few sales. I don't think I make a lot. Especially strategy games are especially popular. Ah, I got you so covered. I got you so covered. Let's develop that. If that one finishes, there we go. Racing and action is a good combination. Artificial it seems to be very important. Thought so. And the audience match. Young gambling is great. Develop a new game. Genre. Stra was it strategy? I think it was strategy. Um, on the Weaselkind and on the PC. I think strategy goes really well on the PC, so let's just do that. Um, topic, oh, good question, good question. <sighs> um, a medieval one. And we're gonna call it uh, Strong Bold. Strong, strong, strong Bold. That's what we're gonna call it. Mature? Nah, we're gonna go... Wait, PC is... Everyone. Yeah, let's go with everyone. Strategy, medieval, PC, everyone. For the Weaselkind engine. Go. Let's see how that goes. 3D graphics, definitely, definitely. Why not? Like, nice top-down isometric view. And the TS has been released. I should have waited a little bit longer. 
Gameplay is very important. Engine, yeah, yeah, why not? And give it a story. I think we should, like, develop a new engine eventually. Let's make a few more games, though. Artificial intelligence level design. Um, yeah, I like this. Gonna be fine, don't worry. I've done this a million times. I know what I'm doing. I'm lying. Hmm. Field sound is not that important. Let's hope that this does the trick. Oh, we're gaining a few points, but not as much as I'd like. Um, marketing magazines. A little bit of hype. Let's get rid of those nasty, nasty bugs. Uh, they need to recharge. I better even go vacation. Oh. Okay. Well, but she doesn't need a vacation. She doesn't. She's fine. Don't believe me. Ah, uh, nearly half a million. Nice. Come on. Give me... There we go. One of these days I will release a game with box, just because I don't pay attention. Release the game! Why would I trash it? Why would I trash that game? Okay. Let's hope we get some nice reviews. Ooh, yeah! Ooh, yeah! Check that! Another 10! That's another hit, guys! Neato! It's like my head, it's bald and awesome! Everyone loves it! Also, just like my head. Ah, oh, it's an outstanding game. Woohoo! Let's, let's generate a game report, just because I don't have like a cue there. Set a new standard for the early gaming industry, cult status! Yay! Whatever that means, by setting like that. Ooh, 500k in one week! This is so delicious! Mmm, yum 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 yum. Post-release analysis of Stronghold is complete, is a great combination. Level design seems to be important. And the genre match. Good. What is that? Oh, that is the... What? Bonnie? All oh, right, right, right. Didn't they want to make add, like an extension to the SNES? And that's never gonna happen, so they make their own with a CD drive? Oh, yeah, right, there it is. They have turned sour. So now Nintendo announced that it will cancel the project. And um, so... That is when Sony's PlayStation was born. The play system. Anyway, let us... Should we should we develop a new game, create a new engine, or... Storm of Good Reviews. One of the rare games that will new set quality standard. <laughs> we made gaming history. Awesome. We have a lot of cash, so we could definitely develop a new engine. Or fill a new position. I'm just saying. I'm gonna save the game. I'm gonna... Fill the position. Don't try to everyone at once, as staffs are expensive. Many rookies hire too early and go bankrupt. Take it slow. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we're gonna take it slow. We're actually going to take it slow. Um, you could go on vacation, actually. Send a vacation, and you could create a new engine. Wait, we need to do re some research first. Without research, we don't have many things we could add to that engine. You are going to research simple cutscenes. Ooh, medium games. Do I need that for? Oh right, I, I think I need that for like if I have it more with three people, more than three people, something like that. Eh, I don't know. Better dialogues. Let's research the simple things. The TS will be taken off the market. I don't care. I don't really care. We have a lot of fans. We have nearly 8.9k, nearly 10k fans. That is more than I have on my channel. I should have been in the... Well, I also like took seven years, so... I might be there in seven years, too. Or in five or six, something like that. Um, let's research... Simple cutscenes, and you are going to research... A level editor. Why not? It's not that expensive. Doesn't cost too many research points. It's off the market. Sold 400k units. Oh, we're gonna build a really awesome engine there. And we're gonna use... Um, when they're done... I think we should... No, not fire. You're gonna research open world and... Should she, like, get the... 2D graphics? Oh, she can't because I don't have enough research points. Okay, that's fine. Um, well, the TS is, not, TS is no longer supported. We could train her. Um, oh, now it shows me those things. You know what? 
give her... Let's train her just so I have the effects of this training listed. Also, training your employees is not the worst idea ever. Uh, no, no strong trends right now, and you are going to get, learn about game design. I assume that helps for design. Um, they will eventually want a race. She eventually wants a race, I'm pretty sure. <sighs> Let's wait for them to finish learning. What is that? Mars Space Commander. Yeah, I could call a game like that. Um, that is a... What is that? That is a TS? Uh, a Super Nintendo? I don't even know what that is. Research train. No, we're going to create a custom engine, a new one. With um, better dialogues, a level editor, an open world, mono sound, all those things. Um, yeah, why not 3D graphics? Like, actually, just add 2D graphics. Eh. It is called. No, we're gonna go with 3D. The Weaselkind 2. The Weaselkind 2. Um, or let's call it the. No, let's call it the. Weaselkin 2. Let's create that engine. I know, not a very creative name. Uh, feel free to suggest names for engines. That is definitely we might need. Might, might not, I don't know. But the Weaselkin 2, that is what the industry is waiting for, or at least our little office. Um, not gonna fill the position. Not yet. Not yet. With the next engine. With the next engine, we're gonna do that. We should be able to, like create a new hit title, a second hit title, eventually. It's now complete, wonderful, so we are going to research new topics as well. I'm gonna go with fantasy, and you're going to research... Ooh, horror, I like horror. Horror, horror, hero, horror. Let's do that, let's create a horror game. Fantasy horror. I think we can mix up two genres eventually, but not yet, I think. Not yet. Come on, finish it up. Yay, completed. Let's create a new game. Time for that. Develop a new game. Mm. Fantasy. Uh, RPG. Um, and we're gonna call it the Sibling Scrolls. S sibling Scrolls. Yep. Or no, the Youngling Scrolls. I like that. Uh, it is for... I'd, I'd go with the PC, actually. Um, because RPG and whatnot. On the Weaselkin 2. There we go. Everyone, Weaselkin 2. Yeah, nice 3D graphics. Let's do that. Um, what was important? Story quest, definitely not that important. Not that important. Mm, like this. Uh, simple cutscenes. Yeah, let's just let's just throw everything at this game that we possibly can. Okay. Uh, level design, quite important, not that important. Dialogue's very important for an RPG. Better dialogues, yeah, let's throw more money at this project. And let's do some marketing. Uh, magazines and demos, yes. Just type 7. Uh, it moves up, so that's good. <sighs> Open world, because, you know, scrolls. And we're gonna go with nice world design, nice sound. Um, that balance seems to be fair, or good. Uh, marketing, let's throw, you know what, let's throw some magazines in there as well, just like additionally. That's a nice hype and that's a nice high design standard there. Let's see if we can squish those bugs and maybe add a little bit more to the design. Yay, we can. Ah, <sighs> wonderful. That's a new record, totally. It's a new combo. Is it a great combo? Eh, it doesn't give the great combo bonus anymore, I think. It doesn't do that. So, wait, level 3. Is that for Weasel or is that for... Oh, in general, in general. Versati uh, versatile. Release a successful game in each one of the five main genres, I think. Ooh, character progression. And now we have 3D graphics version 2. Eh, that's fine. Uh, let's generate a game report. And let's see the reviews. Please don't be shabby. Ah, very enjoyable. It's not a big hit, but it definitely will sell good. It's not a loss. 
don't you dare give me a four for that one, my friend. Very good. Very, very good. Let's train you in code incomplete while she's doing work. Yeah, look at that. We well, that is definitely not a lot of money we're making here. 100k. Hmm. Oh, it's moving up a little bit. Okay, we nearly had 10k fans. That's good. So, great combination. Word design seems to be very important. Okay. Ooh, strategy games, especially popular right now. Proposition. Um, 55k and I 54k and I get something. Sure. What do I get? Post-apocalyptic. Fine. Um, I would love to research another strategy game since it's very, very. Ooh, expo. Yeah. Uh, biggest game convention. Uh huh. Yes. Let's go to the G3. Let's do that. Um, but for now, we are going to wait. Create a new game. Um, Post-apocalyptic strategy. Ah, it sounds interesting, but then again, fantasy strategy. Yes, I know I'm not very creative here, but come on, give me a break. Strategy is very popular right now, and it runs well on the PC, so what can I do? On the Weaselkin 2, and it's called Weaselcraft. Yes, I'm so creative. Come on. I want to write it like that. Like the cool kids do. Everyone was on the PC, like... I think mature might be better, but then again, I think that's good enough. I don't want to risk it. Uh, nice 3D graphics. Let's see how Weaselcraft does. Gameplay, very important. It's a good thing that I have so uh, a very good idea about um, strategy games by now from all the uh, game development p reports. Game dev reports. Postmortems. Uh, game Informer and good word that Weaselzone is working on a new game. Would you be willing to share some information? Yeah, sure. Many of readers are curious what decisions go into making video games and how companies prioritize development areas. Your new game is a fantasy strategy game. Can you tell us whether such a game would usually receive more focus on story quest or world design? More on world design. Thank you for your time. Did that give me... No, that did not give me a boost. Uh, let's go with um, magazines. We discussed their upcoming fantasy game. Mm, and you just said world design is of particular importance. Uh, other industry professionals agree. So, did that give me like a boost? I don't think. Level design is important. Dialogues. Eh, 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 eh. That should do the trick. Let's do some more marketing. Magazines and demos. Time for that. I think I don't want to do more hype things now. <sighs> World design was very important. Yes, graphics sound like this. Well, we're doing really well. You know what? I'm gonna throw one more magazine thingy in there. Um, 500k. Yeah, I hope this one gets a hit because otherwise I spent a lot of money on marketing that was not necessary. Possibly, please. Finish! Okay, nice hype, nice high values that are actually pretty well balanced. Um, I think the balancing between those two is very important. And a lot of level ups. It's nice. Better AI and stereo sound. Neat. While we wait... Ah, reviews. Okay, let's hope that Weaselcraft does well. Come on! What? Was the engine too old? I think the engine was too old or something. What a damn shame. Well, at least I got one aid. That's something. Two aids. Eh. Well, let's hope that our fans like push it or that the sales because it's a strategy game take off Well, yeah, we might get our money back. That is nice. Let's see what went wrong with Weaselcraft here um, And I kind of want to like like a small booth start with a small booth for 80k on the G3 for our fans and uh, you could Train something um, What do you need you kind of need design 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 design? Design. Game design for pirates. Let's let's give you some training. And you 
Um, fantasy and strategy is a great combination, and world design seems to be important. That's not that helpful, actually. That was not really well spent time. I could have told you that. Anyway. Let's research better sound, stereo sound, and you could research something else as well. Come on, come on, come on, finish up so you can research. You want, you're not gonna research anything. You're just in the way. So how many fans are coming to our booth? Well, a lot, actually. Wow, many, many fans, surprisingly. 47,000 fans, that's a lot. That's a lot, I feel. Um, not top 100. I mean, come on, we have 11k fans and 12k fans and 50,000 came to our booth. I think that is pretty impressive. I think that is pretty impressive. Nobody told me how big the conference was anyway. How could I know if that is something good? Well, it's not top 100, so... Ooh, the Sony play system. We're going to develop for that so hard. Um... I feel like filling the position with another developer. We might do that in the next one. We can do sequels! Yay! Base our success on older games. Yay! Let's do that uh, in the next episode. Uh, yeah! Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, leave a like. Feel free to share it with your friends or follow me on Weaselzone at, uh, on Twitter at Weaselzone. Anyway, I'm out and I hope to see you around. Bye bye!